things that you've been dealing with during the day. So that's like 101. And I kind of um I kind of coined this thing, man, because when I was coming out of witchcraft, like really dark, demonic witchcraft, um, I called TBN. I needed prayer, right? <laughs> Got somebody to pray with me on the on the prayer lines back in 98. And uh, they gave me the scripture, James 4, 7. And so I do music and stuff and I sign all my CDs, all my posters, all my autographs. I sign it with this scripture, James 4, 7. Submit yourselves to God, resist the devil, and he will flee. And that helped me, man. That was my go-to scripture. I'm coming out of Satanism and witchcraft and demons and all this kind of stuff. So I, that was my my scripture. So um, I've kind of adopted it as a, a formula for spiritual warfare because everything is God, man. All yeah. is God. The Lord is one. Everything, everyone is in God. We're an expression of God. We're in the body of Christ. We're connected. Everything, every single thing. Nothing is separate from God, man. Um, submit yourself to God. If you submit it in every single area of your life, check yourself. You know yourself. If you got hidden sin, if you got things that you haven't been confessing or whatever, you got to confess it, get it out there to the light. Don't do anything in secret, right? Um, submit yourselves to God. Resist the devil. If there's some temptation, if there's things going on that you need to resist, show a little bit of resistance. Show some type of resistance. Submit yourselves to God. Resist the devil and he will flee. And I, I, tr I mean, that's that's my motto and it's it's work and I help people. It's practical. You know what I'm saying? And as deep <laughs> as deep as you want to make it. But um, I really believe, man. And, and, and I do believe that, you know, some of those dark times in our lives were sent by God. I think everything is God. I thank God at this point that I went through that stuff, that I had to fight those demons, that I came through the other side and I got a story to tell and I got a passion in me about this stuff. And I wouldn't have it like. The light is just as important as the darkness. Everybody wants to be in the light as he is in the light. But if, until we are in, in those times of darkness, until we're in, in, in those cave, have those cave moments where we're, run, we're running from the enemies, we don't have a contrast of how beautiful and how marvelous that light is, man. So and I thank I, God for that contrast, man. I really do. I love, I love that because I'm able to look at all the dark, extremely dark times in my life. And I look at that now as like, that allows me to go to places that other people can't go. Yeah. Yeah. Because I I've been through it. I